Um, <laughs> serious. Okay, how do you be serious? Um, there's a lot of challenges when you're on the mission field here in Haiti, but it's really fun. There's constant just giving up your rights. If you're a foreigner not knowing the language, you trust the Lord and then you really go deep with putting um, all your strength, all your hope, all your thoughts in the Lord. Yeah, and you're constantly on the back of motos, motorcycles, on the back of trucks. There's just a lot of adventures and if you want to be doing missions and sharing about the Lord, there's just opportunities everywhere you go. Almost everyone has heard about the Lord and heard about the gospel. Everyone knows about God and they know about the devil. But a, lot, a problem that's here in Haiti is that a lot of people don't know how to apply um, and just walk like with the Holy Spirit just continually in their day-to-day -day life. That it's not just a one-time prayer or a one-time reading of the Bible or even just knowing the Bible, but it's actually like a life, um, it's just your life. One way I do this is by teaching children from our neighborhood how to worship, glorify, and honor the Lord through dance each week at the kids' church we run on our campus. To be in a country that has a history of and is known for their worship of the devil, I love that I get to be here and that I get to teach these kids that they were created to worship the Lord in everything they do, how every movement they make, not only with dance, but in all of life, is supposed to be loving God and loving others. I get to live this out myself as I work in our office with administration, help in practical work in our city and surrounding villages, and help lead and teach students that come for our discipleship schools. My name is Sarah Gilman, and I am a missionary in Haiti.